Chairman of the Coalition Board, Member Secretary, Dr. Shakula, my dear friends of the media. I personally feel there's nothing much for me to say because they've covered both the covered the field. However, with the theme in mind of this summer being structuring the present for a sustainable future, our commitments to action, I think this sums up the whole, the whole summit. Reason being, because we not only believe that we're going to make, make commitments, but those commitments would be converted into actions, which in short means we mean business. The time has come where we recognize our responsibility to ensure good health, good water quality. These are basic essential things needed for the human being. And therefore, it is our endeavor to try and give our best to contribute towards clearing, cleaning of the environment. This summit is going to cover up various topics. There will be 10 plenary sessions, each on the theme on, of sustainable development. First session will be decarbonize, on decarbonization. Second will be green credits. Third will be sustainable mining. Fourth, circular economy. Fifth, climate finance. Sixth, greening of industries. Seventh, scaling up green technology. Eight, pathways to sustainable development. Ninth, water security and conservation. And ten, biodiversity conservation, where experts will discuss, deliberate on issues to arrive at consensus, to continually strengthen the role as well as way forward by various stakeholders. This would explain the entire purpose and spirit of our summit, the various topics that will be discussed, and we hope that we would be able to ensure that we start this year on a strong base, with keeping in mind all these goals that, that I have spoken about. Last year's summit was held, the same summit, many participants took place. I think fruits of it have been seen and that has encouraged the board to decide to organize it again for this, for in the, again now, during this annual year. As our chairman has said, the future today lies in the hands of the startups and that is why we have given focus and importance to start up units also. Besides that, we recognize the fact that students of today are leaders of tomorrow and therefore we have, we have encouraged them to participate in this summit also. With, as I said at the outset, keeping in mind our endeavor to make structuring the present for a sustainable future. If you have any questions, feel free to ask. At our invitation to get this information. As my colleague Dr. Shamila said, we had organized last year first Goa Sustainable Summit at the AGS of Pollution Control Board, which was the sort of idea which the government of Goa proposed to us, Honorable CM, Honorable Minister, and we started really implementing. The main idea behind this was a Pollution Control Board is supposed to be a regulatory authority in a legal point. But however, we want to become a facilitator. That's also our mandate to educate, to impart knowledge of environment. So while doing regulation, we also realize that there is a gap of knowledge. Industry, big or small, do not get the app knowledge, equipment and app services. So with that backdrop in mind, we thought of first such summit last year. We had good response, probably many of you must have attended it. We also had, as Shamila said, an exhibition of different technologies. There were service provider, there were equipment provider, there were waste management, there was STP. And with that success, also we last year we thought we signed an MOU, a couple of organizations who have the action. I'm very happy this year, whatever we planned last year, that has the action, the 
terminated in court action, which our Honorable Minister will tell you more today. So here our, this year, the focus primarily was, or is also apart from what we did last year, to take it one step forward. So we have tied up with the CII, they are our industry partners, who is able to get industry. At the same time, we are fortunate to have a principal scientific advisor of Prime Minister's office, Dr. Sapna Bhoti, they have got this website called the Manthan, and they are supporting young individuals and entrepreneurs like startup. So also our minister as well as CM and our Honorable Prime Minister say always be important startup. So we have made this also startup pavilion. Uh, we have also tied up with this uh, engineering colleges, all Goa, IIT, WITS, NIT, uh, engineering colleges, all we are tied up. And we also told the student can come, they can interact. There will be one pavilion wherein uh, Dr. Sapna Koti, who is a Prime Minister's office in charge of this particular cell, would be mentoring those people. So we have got one step forward in doing this. Uh, apart from our technology, innovation, and our knowledge sharing, we have got a host of good speakers like last year on different subjects, circular like economy, climate change, uh, waste management, uh, mining, reclamation, all these things covered. Uh, more details are in your SK, and I will catch up the minister to give the overview of function.